Hello class, my name is Mr. Grobart. I will be your instructor today in this, the Advanced Beginners iPhone Users Group. Uh, many of you may have just gotten an iPhone for the first time through Verizon. Others may be holding on to an older AT&T model, but no matter, we're going to learn a few tips and tricks that are going to make using your iPhone a little easier and a little bit more convenient. Shall we get started? Okay. First, I would like to direct your attention to the home button. I'm sure you're already familiar with that. However, I bet you didn't know, if you double tap the home button and start swiping to the left, you will move in reverse chronological order to all the apps that you've been using on your phone. I've drawn an equation here to illustrate this. Two times home button equals Marua, a little concept I've developed, which means most recently used apps. Double tapping the home button also unlocks other features. If, as I've written here in the formula, you double tap the button and then swipe to the right, you will see iPod controls, allowing you to pause or advance music while you're doing something else. Also, you'll have access to the screen rotation lock button, which allows you to lock your screen in one orientation so your iPhone doesn't keep switching between portrait and landscape. You can always go back into there and turn it off as needed. The last thing I'd like to go over with you today are app folders, which are a really good way to organize all the apps that you're downloading onto your iPhone. It's very simple. One, press and hold down on any app icon on your iPhone screen. You'll start to see all the other icons start to jiggle. Two, drag apps on top of each other. As you do that, it will open up a new panel on your iPhone screen, which will allow you to create a folder. Three, you're going to be able to name that folder. The iPhone's going to pre-populate the screen with a name it thinks you want, and that might be good, or you may wish to change it. Four, click the home button to exit this mode. When you do that, all the other icons will stop jiggling, and you'll be back in normal user mode. Okay, class, I think we're out of time. Um, as you're packing up your things, please remember, I'm teaching a survey course next semester, Compaq K-Pro Wang Age of Empires. If you are interested, there will be a sign-up sheet outside of my office. Thanks, folks.